First of all, before we get into this, I just want to say Bungie has been cooking something special with Final Shape, man. They wanted to make sure people made understood why there was a delay for this thing. Oh my god. But outside of that, I wanted to kind of analyze over some of the gameplay stuff. Obviously, yeah, there's like all the stuff. And if you want just a review of it and like someone's thoughts on it, you can go find that like other places because I'm sure there's 300,000 other channels doing that right now. Which granted, mine's probably not going to end up too different. But I kind of wanted to analyze and go a little deeper and talk about like what this could mean for Final shape rather than just like look new subclass isn't that cool but yeah but first obviously big one just said it new subclass is coming which looks actually crazy genuinely a game breaking addition like i dude it just feels like huge that there's a crazy last subclass the only thing i wish about the new subclass is that it potentially could have been like a new darkness subclass or there's some new darkness stuff with it but you know what it's cool enough on its own cheaters are in ruins right now with the fact that they're not the only ones that can use more than one subclass on uh uh, on a character yeah um i like it's just i it's still revolutionary it would have been kind of cool to see a new darkness subclass but i think i honestly i think this is probably a lot better this is a lot cooler than any dark, darkness subclass could ever be aside from maybe siva but the only thing i want to see with this is just to make sure that other classes don't, don't really go obsolete because they're adding the new supers anyways but like Dude, this one looks so good comparatively because you not only get your super from a subclass, you get to mix things, you get aspects, like stuff like that. It just seems like it's going to make every other subclass just not worth it to run. I'm sure they have something where you can only pick a specific aspect from each subclass. Like you can only pick Consecration from Titan Solar. You can only pick Feed the Void from Warlock Solar warlock void but i don't know man we haven't seen too much so obviously can't say too much and it also looks like they're planning on making sure that it's not just like there's specific fragments for that for the like prismatic subclass rather than like you can just pick and choose from each um subclasses fragments but i don't know i just don't want to see it overshadow literally every other subclass just for how good it is but this really does make the game like final shape seem very forsaken as not to compare literally everything to forsaken but that's just kind of the best example i have right now because new like it's like revolutionary for the game even more so than Forsaken, I'd say, because the new subclasses for Forsaken were cool, and the new way they did it was cool, but this is just a new level of stuff. Going off with that, the exotic items look sweet, but, like, these alone, if they just added these in, would break the game, because, like, dude, two, two exotic perks and like one thing is crazy especially too with what you could do with that the, yeah the exotics are going to be sweet they do seem to be a little bit balanced because you know you can only it seems like you can only equip just the like either like an exotic or just an exotic class item which is is good because otherwise it'd just be great it'd be insane and also like it looks like it only takes like one or maybe probably just one thing from each exotic like where it's like oh you can have more melee damage like syntheseps or you can have more super with i don't know but it seems like they're trying to balance that out which is good but yeah those look sweet i really hope they uh are not just the final shape ones and they can actually be transmogged and other things otherwise fashion is in ruins the coolest thing that's going to come out of all of this though i think is going to be the builds are going to be genuinely actually insane like i know strand titan is kind of stupid right now but these builds are going to be dumb i tell you what not to be too optimistic but it looks like we might be finally getting more than four buffs or debuffs in the column which would be so nice because oh my god i can't believe it has not been added until now if that is true you know it'd be it'd be pretty nice if they did that bungie with some of the ways they've been talking and some of the stuff they've been showing in this stuff like in this showcase though dude these activities are gonna be hard final shape is not gonna be like just easy like i know they've had the legendary mode and stuff for witch queen and lightfall but oh I, it, like it looks way harder than that outside of the new enemy types which since i haven't personally interacted with them i can't i don't want to say too much on that because i low-key suck at interacting with enemies i kind of like sometimes make really dumb decisions but enough about me dude these activities like seem like they're gonna be genuinely tough and hard like a just i dude i don't know man it's not gonna be like classic d2 where it's like oh i'm gonna hop on go do my pinnacles and then be out in like 30 minutes it's gonna be i'm gonna hop on for an hour and a half do one thing and be like oh my that was hard but personally i like i like to see that because one we're getting way stronger it seems and two like i don't know i just don't i, I like seeing a, like harder stuff in the game that's not just like gm minus 20 difficulty but i don't know that's kind of the easiest way to do it it's probably gonna have a little bit of that aspect to it but this just looks all all around promising for more engaging more fun activities the only thing i want anyone 
anyone who is still watching to take away from this is one final shape looks like it should be really good it should be awesome it like has everything there to be good but obviously this comes with like any new game big update big dlc there's probably going to be bugs especially so that there's like considering the new subclass in exotics there is just no way that there's no buggy interactions between those or at least nothing that's like super weird i don't know i don't want to dog on final shape with that i just want to make sure people like aren't just like way 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 over hyping it with that i'm gonna go drop a hundred bones on final shape and play some onslaught see ya